Yo, what is going on guys? You already know, it's the Pro Bartlett coming at you guys with a new playthrough. This is the Skya. I believe that's how you pronounce it. I'm not entirely sure. But basically, uh, they just released a port for PC on Steam, 20 bucks. I've been wanting to play this series for a long, long, long time, but unfortunately, all the games are PlayStation exclusive, except for one of them, which I believe is on the 3DS. So when they, when I saw this game back in like January, I was like, dude, I've got to get it. So, apparently this is a port from the PlayStation 2, Skya, something of darkness, I'm not entirely sure. But apparently it's a port from that game, and it has all the DLC included from the previous game. Um, that's all I really know about it. I, I, I've been itching to play this game, so we are going to play it. I decided not to put a webcam or a face cam because... Well, King Hrydrevskoy, the mighty ruler of the netherworld. His long reign came to an abrupt end as the news of his death spread throughout the Dark Land. Ambitious demons rose one after another to seize the opportunity. And thus began the age of turbulence and anarchy. Two years later, Prince. Prince, <coughs> wake up! Like I was saying, um, oh, first of all, sorry if you keep hearing me sniffle. I've got the sniffles. That's just something I always have. I have really bad allergies. Anyway, I decided not to put a webcam. Uh, or a face cam in yet because I wasn't sure entirely if I would be blocking content so I decided not to go with the face cam this time I might put it back in depending on if it's not going to mess up like the gameplay and whatnot but yeah, sorry about the pictures. I've got them I have terrible allergies like I used to be medicated heavily for that shit. It was not good. <coughs> we just have to get shot and shit. It wasn't a very what? fun time of Wake up! Well, if that's the case, there's only one thing left to do. Uh, what? what fool dares awaken me, the great Lahar? I'm glad you're still alive. Who said I was dead? I was just taking a nap. Mm, that's what they all say. Anyways, so why are all those weapons behind you? Dude, do I get to pick one? Tell me I get to pick one. Come on, man. Like, tell me I get to pick one. I was having a hard time waking you up. Are you sure you weren't trying to kill me instead? No! Uh, I mean, yes. I, I just wanted to wake you up. <laughs> Whatever. So, what is it? You better have a good reason for waking me up. Oh, yeah! Oh, thanks, uh, thanks for letting me know. Wait a second. Mm. 
So you're telling me that I've been sleeping for over two years? Uh, basically, yeah, that's basically what yep. she's saying. Awkward. Oh, he yep. looks like he is. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? <coughs> I bet she tried. But she got me. Excuse me, but what do you think I've been doing all this time? The Netherworld has gone to hell while you were sleeping. My fault if some other demon steals the title of Overlord. What? Have they forgotten whose title they're trying to steal? <laughs> How bold of them! I shall show no mercy, for I am the Harl, the rightful heir to the throne! At all. Your humble vassal Etna will accompany you. All right. Episode one: Prince of the Netherworld. Episode one: Prince of the Netherworld. Your boy is on a quest. To get back what is his, I'm telling you. Oh, I can move. Oh, snap. Okay, let's check everything out. Let's see. Let's go to our settings. Uh, I think everything's fine. You can put the. Ooh, people are gonna love this. You can put the voice into Japanese or English. Um, uh -huh. So far, all we can do is open up the, uh, the menu. Tell me I get to pick one of these. A lovely morning star. A cool looking drill. Why not, like, let me have one of these. Come on. I will say. The movement is not very smooth. I am playing with a controller, so that may be why. But it, I, I'm pretty sure that is why, because when I was playing Oceanhorn, uh, the movement didn't feel all that great due to uh, the controller. But I am playing with a controller, because I'm a little, I'm a little close like that. Dude, what's up with that line? A dragon. Are they my buddies? They might be. Can I sit in my throne? Can't sit in my throne. That's just like you, friends. Taking a two year nap. I only planned on napping for uh, about ten days and uh... Hmm, something's not right. Well, looks like I wasted my time digging that grave for you. I'll put you in the grave instead. Can't believe you just back talked me like that. Who is this person? Under construction. I'll please come back later. <laughs> and all these monsters out here. In order to prevent insurance, I have closed all the gates. Please talk to the dimensional gatekeeper if you'd like to leave the castle. Yeah, whatever. You probably just didn't want to watch the gate. Well, who's the dimensional gatekeeper? I feel a breeze, dude. This castle is getting old. Good morning, Prince. How are you feeling? Yeah, couldn't be worse. My body feels really stiff from sleeping too much. Uh, why don't you warm up on a tutorial map? Go see the Dimensional Gatekeeper and she'll send you there. Well, considering uh, I don't know who that is at this time... Um... Is there a problem, Prince? I... Long genius... Aim at your service. Would you like to know about a weapon? I mean, not really. I was hoping you'd give me one. 
I guess not. That was boring. No, no, it's, it's okay, it's okay, I don't need your services. <coughs> so I have to find this dimensional gatekeeper. Oh, maybe? Tutorial. Items can be purchased at the Rosenquin Co. Netherworld branch. Each character can equip up to four items. A character can equip one weapon and three other items. Such as armor, monsters can only equip weapons from the monster only weapons category. It is best to equip a weapon that suits you. A character, or er, suits, yeah. You know what I mean. I wonder if I can buy anything. Battle Depot. Welcome to the Rosen, Ross and Rosen Queen Company of the World Branch. We are hard work, day and night, yeah. It's constantly changing, okay. Well. Yeah, I just went to the browse. Like, let, me, let me browse. Come on. I have 300, like, I guess, gold coins. Don't know what these are called yet. I could buy some stuff. But I'm not entirely sure what I need. I can try. Well, these don't have any... Uh, I'll, I'm gonna pass for what about the weapons? Can I buy weapons? Oh, this is a weapon shop. Let me see. Yes, please. Just I don't. I don't. Don't give me the whole spill of your whatever or not. I just want to know if I can buy a weapon. Come on. Yes. 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 I know. Okay. So. I can buy a weapon. I can buy a common sword. I mean, I could buy anything here. What is this, a gun? Common axe. Okay, I'll come back. I have a bad feeling, like, what, like, what if I find a weapon? What if I just end up finding one? Tori, welcome to the Netherworld Hospital. <coughs> we will treat your wounds and heal any damage you have taken. We will, of course, charge you. You can earn prizes based on the total HP and SP you recovered, so please. Okay. I don't want to get treated. What about you? Judith? This is the Item World Gateway Center. We are not open yet. Here we go. How do you save yet? When you want to save, press 4 to open the menu and save. So press Y. That, that's basically what it was, yeah. You can only save in the in the uh, Overlord's Castle. Once you enter an area map, there's no turning back, so be careful. Okay. So I will be saving. Save. I'm probably going to start using the um, keyboard and mouse just because this game is turn-based, so it's not like I really have to do anything. Okay, I'm the Dimensional Gatekeeper. I will input the coordinates of your desired destination, Prince, and you will instantly be transported there. Please select where you would like to go. I guess, yes. How do I... Yo! Uh, I can't do the tutorial. Okay, cool. Um, battle basics. Now then, time for a little warm up. I feel a little rusty. Ah, uh, Prince, we've got company. How convenient. Stray demons, huh? Allow me, Prince. You may be a little out of practice after your long slumber. <laughs> Don't worry, I came prepared. Come on, pretty squad! Okay, so, uh... Get your butts out here! 
I'm sitting here like... Uh, uh, uh. Is she summoning these guys? So, Prince, what do you think of this pretty squad I hired? They're my loyal servants. They'll do anything I say. Huh, interesting. They look very intimidating. Oh, snap. Oh, God. Are you sure about that? Yeah, that's, that's kind of what I'm saying. I, I, I don't know. These guys look, uh, look very, um... I mean, don't judge a book by his cover. Oh, shit. Okay. She's getting them in gear. Oh snap, she done shot him. See? They're loyal! Does it make sense to beat up your allies before a battle? Anyways, I think we've made those demons wait long enough already. Them to be so patient. Yeah, that's considerate of them. To show my appreciation, I'll only beat them half to death. Oh, you're so kind. If I were you, I'd beat them all the way to death. C kind? Stop that. That word gives me goosebumps. Damn it! I take it back. I'm gonna beat them all the way to death. He's still a kid, so quick-tempered. It looks like carrying out my plan would be a lot easier than I thought. Uh-oh. You say something! Oh, nothing! Nothing at all! So, what are your orders, Prince? You do remember how to fight, right? Well, is she gonna try to overthrow us? What a bitch. Okay. Tutorial basics of battle. Just in case you forgot, let me explain the basics of battle. Move the cursor over the base panel and press 1 to select the characters you wish to dispatch. Okay, so I can dispatch all these. Oh, they're doing it for me. Okay. Go to cancel in order to dispatch a character, move the cursor over the character and press 2. For example, if you press 2 here... You can cancel the action. Now let's issue a command to a, dis to a dispatched character. First move him, slash our next one. Right there. Action. However, the character won't attack immediately. If you want to execute the actions that you've assigned, open the menu and select either Execute or Enter. In this case, let's pick Execute. Okay, so that, that's a little different than other turn-based strategies that played. See, the character attacked. Assign actions, execute, remember this, you'll be using it a lot. <coughs> if you assign actions to multiple characters, they will be executed in the order that you assign them. Be careful, you can't cancel actions once you've chosen to execute them. After you're done issuing commands, open the menu and end your turn. It will that be the ending start. So all this looks pretty simple, as far as, you know, turn-based. Um, oh god, they're all ganging up on me, though. 
Like, why would the tutorial move me all the way over? <laughs> look at this. Like, look at this. I just died. Ow! Why do I have to be the one to do this? I'm the next Overlord. I'm crying out loud. Uh, that was an example of something not to do. Only an idiot would go straight into the enemy alone. You put me there! Like, you fucking put me there! You made me do- See? He agrees. Characters killed in battle, like our prince here, can be revived by paying hell to... So that's what the HL stands for, by paying hell to the castle's hospital. If all of your dispatched characters are defeated, the game will be over. So, the basic idea is to gang up on one character and beat the living daylight out of them, huh? Oh, exactly, Prince. I mean, remember to use your head next time, duh. Well, you're the one who told me to do it. Team attacks sometimes occur when allies are positioned next to attacking characters. If several characters attack the same enemy in a row, a combo will result and rare damage will be dealt. If you want to know more, press 4 and select help from the menu. That seems pretty straight. Alright, do I get to do this myself now? Oh snap, I get to do this myself, okay. Oh, I'm gonna move, I'm gonna be smart. So far, this looks straight. <coughs> See, I'm gonna be smart. Like, they don't know. I'm a turn-based god. I've been playing turn-based games or something. They don't know what I've been through. I don't think I'm gonna move another character. I think I'm just gonna attack. This should be enough. And these two. Okay, now how do I execute? <laughs> I kind of forgot how to do that. Ah, there we go. Yeah, yeah, I killed an enemy. <laughs> oh god, these penguins don't do anything. Okay, la la, they, they do something. They don't do much, but they, 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 they try. They're trying. I mean, that's actually not... That's pretty good. Alright. Um, I guess I'm just gonna have my experience. What's a bonus? Bonus? Okay, so that's when you would want to use, like, items, I guess? Probably? I'll just my turn. Seems fair, right? Seems like... What else? Oh, they're gonna gang up on me? Oh, that's a mistake, dog. They shouldn't be trying to gang up on me. Okay, so it's my turn again. Pretty funny. <coughs> oh, okay. Did we get 
get the kill? That's the question. Yeah, we do. Not bad. Not bad start. Get a kill bonus. So we get hell. We get 37 health and make go. All right. That was pretty fun. Um, I'm going to stop the episode here. I believe we're running on probably like 20 plus minutes. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you are hyped, if you are hyped just like I am for this game, give the video a like. That would be greatly appreciated. Um, subscribe if you would like to continue to see more. And comment. Let me know what you think about the series so far. It looks pretty good. Um, I think the graphics could be a little bit better. But for 20 bucks, I mean, I'm not complaining. Anyway guys, you already know, it's the Pro Bartlett. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode.